Hey you guys, it's Bree and welcome to my channel. So today I'm going to be showing you guys how to bake a wash and go. So this look is really good for the winter when you don't want to go outside with your hair technically wet but you want the look of a wash and go. So it's still a wash and go in part but I'm going to show you how to bake it. So I'm starting off on freshly washed hair, freshly washed and conditioned hair and i'm gonna section it off and for this look you want your hair to be very defined so i'm going to be using my texture id styling cream Oop. can't waste it Now I'm doing this style without any tools because I get the best definition when I just finger comb through my hair. My first look, I will take you back a little while before I'm going to do a big wet run with this style on it. And last but not least, I'm going to add just a little bit of a light oil as this rose leaf gold. Just a little bit. Alright. And now what I'm going to do is stick up this gold color very lightly. and set it to the side. Wrong person. Now I'm gonna repeat this process all around my head.
so I'm on the final side of my hair. I just wanted to show the process one more time. Get a section. And I'm also almost out of my styling cream. But that's okay, just use a little water, make it spill. So we're gonna spray the section with water because by now my hair is pretty dry. Let me get my last styling cream. products work well together they do not flake up on your hair it will be clear when it dries so I'll see you guys when it dries hey guys so it's about two days later and my hair is about 90% dry so we're gonna start the take down process and all you need is a pick and if you're worried about furs, you may need some oil. Okay, so first I'm just going to undo my twist and separate it. For the most part, if you add a gel or anything that works to define your hair really well, make sure you know that your hair should separate pretty nicely because your, cur your curls were already set before you twisted it, the twist just kind of helps with you not having to wrap around with your curls up, basically. So you're going to go through and unravel your twist, and this is your pick. Shake it a little bit and style however you'd like to. You have a dry, curly wash and go. I usually go in with my pick and fluff it because I really like a lot of volume. And I style it. 
however so i went ahead and styled and flooped it to my liking off camera and these are the finished results and my hair is dry keeping it in the twist really helped reduce the frizz that you could get from a wash and go so and as the days go by my hair will get a lot more voluminous so this is the finished result Hey you guys, so this is day two of my wash and go and as you can see it's still pretty curly and defined. I have some frizz but there is a good bit of volume. So thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next video.